the evidence of these prior incidents be in, in proving the case against Derek Chauvin? Very powerful. Prosecutors, we love these prior bad acts evidence. And, you know, I originally thought Cahill wasn't going to let any of this in, right? That was his, uh, at least the direction he was heading in. And I think when he let part of the 2019 Floyd arrest come in to go to the medical issues, and then he kind of took a step back and said, okay, if I'm going to let part of the previous Floyd arrest come in, then it's only fair to let some of this prior bad acts evidence. I think it's very powerful, helps dirty up Chauvin, and to show at least the first incident and the second that, hey, he knew what he was doing, and he chose not to in this case. This was deliberate and to help prove that intent.